What's up, Paisanis? Welcome to the Italian Guys Food Tour. So, I was at the store and getting some, not Mountain Dew, some ginger ale today. All right, need a backup. So, and I saw these chips on the, on the thing. And they said, dirty potato chips. I never heard of them. Dirty potato chips. So I had to get a couple of flavors. All right, first of all, we got some sea salt. Don't expect too much out of that. But we'll see. But the one I'm really interested in, Maui onion. Right there, baby. Dirty potato chips. We're going to see. We're going to start off with the uh, sea salt from the dirty potato chip. We're going to see. All right, so small bag. You don't get too much. Let's see the old uh, smell test. All right, so dirty potato chips. Smells and looks is the inside of the bag. Like ladies. So, let's see what's going on here. Yeah, oh, there you go. All right. It kind of looks a combination between Lay's and Cape Cod, but we're going to say. Wow. Is this by them? Dirty potato chips. We cook our chips, kettle, okay. Peanut oil, blah, 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 blah. Wow. I mean, if I didn't see a different bag, I would have said this was uh, Cape Cod potato chips all, all day long. Wow. I'm just reading to see if it's, they're associated with them at all. Nope, not that I see. Anyways, the sea salt is Cape Cod all over. Not too salty, Sally. It's good. It's it Cape Cod all over the place. Absolutely. Now, we're going to see when we try the Maui, see what's different. Maui onion. But as far as the sea salt, it's all Cape Cod. Absolutely. Okay. So, Maui onion. From dirty potato chips. Alright. I'm dying to smell what Maui onion smells like. Can't, I haven't smelled it before. A little whiter chip. I hope there's something in the taste. I'm not getting nothing. Fantastic, yeah, yeah. All right, so a little bit of a whiter chip. Now, the other one had like more brown and stuff, but the smell you can't tell from the smell. Let's taste it. Okay, very familiar. Maui onion. Hmm. You know, tastes familiar. You know what it tastes like? I'm tasting sour cream. This one's a little salty. Got all over my old lips.
it's not too crazy, okay? But from my 53 years on this planet, if I had to compare biting this, in, biting into this chip, it is salty. But it's not like boom salty. It's more of like, all right, picture this. Follow me now. As if you stuck your face, just your lips, into, all right, say you went down to Revere Beach, okay? Back in the 80s. And you stuck your lips into the ocean and then into the sand. That feeling is what you get here. Kind of like a blanket of salt. It's not flavor issue salt. It's just, there's something about it, like a covering. I mean, let's read the bag a little bit more. A little salty. Um, I'm not really getting anything, ba ba ba, taste your chip, ba ba ba, okay, gluten-free, kettle style, in peanut oil blend, kosher certified. So, I'm not really, it ain't bad, so you're gonna get a thumbs up. But not an enthusiastic thumbs up, you know? I don't know. I've never been to Maui tasting their chips, so I don't know what Maui, what brings into it. Onion? The closest thing, I don't taste onion, but could just be the Italian guy, I don't know. I taste sour cream. A light sour cream and very salty. It ain't bad though. What is that? Oh. Alright, so. For all you chip lovers, you know. I've only seen the brand Dirty Potato Chips in sub shops, pizza shops, stuff like that. I personally have never noticed it in a regular supermarket. I don't know why. But anyways, it's pretty good. A little salty with the Maui onion. I would prefer the sea salted potato chips. And yes, my closest thing that I can compare it to, so you guys have a flavoricious idea, is Cape Cod potato chips. Now, with that said, they are good. Very good, a little salty. I know they have other flavors, and I'll be bringing them to you when I find them. Anyways, thumbs up from the Italian guy for dirty potato chips. I hope they washed them before they put them in the bag. Joke, ha ha ha. Anyways, very salty, very thick covered salt. But 290 calories. This one's 300. It keeps going. Holy shit. Anyways, thanks for watching the Italian Guys Food Tour. We'll be back. Have a good day. I was going to pick up my shirt and show you guys a brand new Italian, Italian Guys Food Tour shirt. But the place closed early. Oofa. Hey, you know, what are you going to do? So I'm going to try it tomorrow. Give him a call and go, hey, do you know who this is? That's right. It's Big Phil. Phil's the name. Don't forget it. It slipped out, but hey, Phil's the name. This is the Italian Guys Food Tour. My subscribers like that shirt that I've shown them. I want to put it out there. And I'm still waiting for you guys, okay? So I'm going to go back and go, like I said, hey, this is a me, okay? I need him a shirt. So... I gotta put it on the old camera here and wear it for the fans and see who wants one. 
All right. So anyways, sure it's a coming. Hopefully, you know. Look for the guy up there. It's only a shirt. Come on now. All right, anyways, I'm not going to ramble. Thanks for subscribing. Dirty Pale Chips, they're okay. Thumbs up. And manja, we'll get yourself some, maybe for the big game. Thanks. Have a good day.